Hello, I'm Amanda from Family Fun for the Family and welcome to Pizza Day. Um, super excited, I thought I would make pizza for my kids for dinner tonight. And while I do that, I thought I'd show you how easy and quick it is to make. So I pre-programmed pizza dough into um, Cookie Do from my app and that links directly to my Thermomix. So let's start cooking. Lightly grease a large bowl with oil and set aside, which I've just done here. 220 grams of lukewarm water. Yeah, I'm going to over a little bit on that, it's okay as well. Sometimes it's fun to try and get it right on as well. Uh, one teaspoon of sugar or malt powder, I don't actually do that. Uh, 20 grams of fresh yeast or dried instant yeast, I just use this one, so I'm going to do two tablespoons of that. When I pop it in there, I make sure I actually pop it in the water, not on the blade as well. I'm just going to pop the lid on. Press next. And that's going to mix together for about 20 seconds. So this is a super quick, easy um, recipe to make. Um, one that my kids love as well. Uh, and I usually make it in the morning or around lunchtime and just pop it. Uh, in a warm spot to rise and then later on in the afternoon after school pickup I usually make the pizzas or well, the kids can help me make the pizzas as well. Okay, 400 grams of baker's flour. I usually buy this in about five kilo lots I think it is. Just going to tear that back to zero. Before I had a Thermomix I would never make pizza dough. At least I know now that I'm making it, I know exactly what's in it as well. Okay, so we've done 407 grams, so we're close enough. Pressing next, 30 grams of extra virgin olive oil. Uh, don't often put the salt in either. Just pop the lid on. Press next. And that's actually going to knead it for about two minutes. So two minutes of kneading the Thermomix is around 20 minutes of hand kneading. I don't have the time to do that, so the Thermomix does it for me. While um, the Thermomix is on the, the kneading mode, um, it's best to stay near the Thermomix in case it bounces around a bit. So we don't want it falling off the bench. Um, so once that's all kneaded together, I'll pop it into the bowl. Um, pop some glad wrap over the top, pop it to a space to rise or prove. Um, usually it takes around half an hour to arrive from the is, but I just let it sit for a couple of hours because I can get the kids to come down to school. Um, and then, then you can um, pop them in the oven ready for dinner. Okay, so we've got 10 seconds to go. And that's our pizza dough. That into my pre-oiled pre -oiled dish. Pop some glad wrap over the top. One of my tips is too when you're putting glad wrap over the top, pop some olive oil underneath the glad wrap so it doesn't stick to the glad wrap and it proves. Okay, and that'll go into a nice warm spot. It's ready for pizza to dinner. Ready for pizza for dinner on pizza day. Um, so what I'll do now is I'll pop some water and a bit of dishwashing liquid in here and pop it into the pre-clean mode. Super simple. So if you're making pizza on pizza day, make sure you send me a picture or tag Family Fun for the family in your posts. Look forward to seeing them. See ya, have a great day.